Hey, YouTubers, good morning, Rob Muffet. Guys, today we want to talk about a food you can make yourself if you're a prepper. This would be a food that would keep for a very long time and store in very, very small spaces and rather inexpensive when you consider everything. And it's got a proven track record. This particular food is, uh, here in America, we call it granola. In Europe, it's called uh, muesli or muesliks. This particular preparation is a recipe is going to be made by Sven Jurven. I, I don't pronounce his last name right. I've been a fan of Sven for a long time. He builds small sailboats and sails them all over the world. He'd be doing it for his whole life, practically. And he's 82. He's getting ready to, to go on another journey. He's building a boat himself like, once again. And in this video he put up on YouTube, he showed how to prepare the the uh the food that he manufactures it's 336 grams of walnuts 980 grams of oats 504 grams of whole milk 252 grams of freeze-dried blueberries 336 grams of raisins 420 grams of almond flour and then he takes the material after he's grinded up and he puts it in bags and and uh vacuum seals it in the bags that are about 680 grams a piece. And when he puts them on his boat, he just has to carry water and some cans of sardines and he lives on his boat for months at a time. And this is how healthy he is, he's 82. So you can see the uh, the results. I'm sure when he goes on shore, this isn't what he eats, but while he's out there on the boats, the thing of it is, if you're a prepper, you might wanna take a look at some of the things that the people who travel around on small sailboats are doing because they're the ultimate preppers and they've been doing it for decades. They are people who don't have any access to outside help. They have to do everything themselves. They have to carry everything they need with them. Um, and, and there's no one, they can't call Amazon. They're, 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 they're living the life of a prepper. They're in a situation where there's nobody to help them. So you look at things that the people in the small boat community are doing. Uh, it's a lot of good, uh, helpful information uh, from, from that community. I think the prepper community could learn from and vice versa. Um, so I'm gonna recommend you check out Sven's video. And this is his channel, Sven. I'll leave a link in the video description. If you're interested in small boats, he's got a lot of cool information. Uh, he's also got a, a, a website where he has some books that he sells about his journeys and so on and other things that he, he, he merchandises to. He's just like a regular guy, old guy. He's trying to make a living. But that's a, it's a very interesting recipe of something that uh, if you had to travel around and you wanted some food that would not take up a lot of space and you could be insured of a lot of nutrition and energy, uh, and something you could do yourself and, and uh, out, you could source the material and get it as cheap as you can. Whereas if you buy freeze dried stuff already made for you, it's gonna cost you an arm and leg. So I hope you check out Seven's channel and that video, I'll leave a link to it. And I think that might be something if you're a prepper and you're, you're trying to find stuff to uh, as many options for things as you can, this is an option maybe you hadn't thought about. All right, guys. Uh, I put on new videos every week, been doing it for 14 years, got over a thousand videos and put stuff on new every week. I can't help myself. All right, guys, see you out there. Thanks for watching.